<laughs> you know, you're almost more trouble than you're worth. something. How is S.H.I.E.L.D. getting along? Is she fitting in well with the rest of the unit? I thought as much. She was born into a prominent military bloodline. Rachel took her in after the death of her parents. At Magnolia Compass, she was put through viciously intense military training. She was constantly tested under extreme stress and chastened for the smallest error. By the time I met her, she'd follow orders without pause. She was precise, almost mechanical. She and Julius were close in age. Perhaps that's why Rachel assigned her to act as his bodyguard. They never truly became friends, though. Maybe because those roles were foisted upon them. Aren't you interested? <laughs> I was the closest thing to a friend she had. I certainly spoke to her more than anyone else at Magnolia Compass. She seems to have begun taking herself a little less seriously since she arrived. It's nice to see her smile. Maybe it's the atmosphere Blood Unit has developed. Even Julius is more approachable than before. Sheil isn't really great with other people, but she seems like she's trying to change. Be nice to her. Thanks for taking the time to talk. I'll see you later.
Mission start. Always nice. when a plan comes together. We have a few moments. Now is the best time to collect supplies. I'm so psyched to do nothing. Are you ready? Are you ready?
I believe I can be of some assistance. My apologies, Vice Captain. I did not intend to take you away from your duties. I've been hoping for an opportunity to speak with you about this for some time. Blood is incredible. They are not only elite warriors, they are versatile, capable, and daring. To be honest, they are far more than I expected. They synchronize without effort, and are constantly aware of not only their own tactical situation, but each of their allies. They've come far. My point being, that the level of strategic capability that they have shown far outstripes my own, far outstripes each of us individually. Vice Captain, I believe this to be the result of the relationships you've developed with us. To be honest, the way blood interacts, I've begun to question all I've been taught as a soldier. <laughs> Please do not misunderstand. It is not a bad feeling. In fact, it's... How can I put this? Um, I... I don't quite know how to explain it. Hmm. I'm sorry for all this. Vice Captain, there is something I wish to ask of you. Please, please be my friend! So, w will you? R really You truly mean that? Thank you. Vice Captain, thank you so much! My apologies, I know this is... an uncommon way to go about it. I've always seen friendship from afar and wanted nothing more. A unit that doesn't rely on orders, but on each other. <sighs> if I may be so bold, I have one more small request to make. May I... Tell others that you are my friend? I am so glad. You know, you're the first friend I've ever had. I cannot tell you how much this means to me. You make me feel so strong and brave. Maybe even enough to grow close to the others as well. <laughs> 